Hello everybody and welcome back to Doom. Hey guys. Oh yeah, I forgot you were here. Oh that's nice. <laughs> you really do care. So much. Um. Um. Well this is fun. You should just jump off the cliff. Or walk backwards, that's cool too. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Yeah, uh, you can take uh, fall da fall damage. You can take fall damage what in this kind of game. What accent is that? <laughs> I don't know what came out of my mouth. It's the Doom accent. That's I wasn't trying to do an accent. It just... You, well, it's playing Doom. It just, you know, it elicits doom, that sort of accent. Doom. No, playing Doom elicits like a Doom, Doom, Doom. Boom. Yeah, these guys. I, I, oh, they don't look very with it. They're not. They're just possessed creatures. Where there's possessed like creatures. What kind of creatures are those? Well, they're humans. Sorry, they're oh. possessed humans. Well, damn. If that's what demon possession does, I don't think it's very good for your health. Uh, no, probably not. Alright, screw it. Wee! That's a fancy shield thing. It's armor. Oh. It's mine now. Okay. All right, where are they? I can hear the growling. Oh, I guess he's dead. New guys. I want Fun. their guns, their plasma rifles, which are my favorite weapon. Um, but once I get the Gauss cannon, I can no longer use it because I use the same um, the same thing. And the, while the Gauss Gauss cannon, um, it's sort of like a weapon that's in between the rocket launcher and the um, BFG. Fun. Yeah. Um, and there's a certain upgrade that makes it like, say half, it, it makes it, I'd actually say it makes it as powerful as a single shot from the BFG. The reason why the BFG is better though is cause it, um, it has more of a explosive radius and you could charge up more than one shot with it. Um, so that's sort of a downside I suppose. Um, but, you know. Gotcha. Uh, I know that there's more. But is there really? I hear more. They See? are literally shooting okay. at me. Okay, there we go. I feel like Doom is the kind of game that'll make you paranoid into thinking no. they're never gone. No, you'll, you'll know when they're gone. Uh, da-da, da-da. Mainly because I can't move forward until they're all dead. Uh, no, thank you. I feel like we're on Mars. See, oh, this, this door is locked Earth. until they all die. Because the way Doom works is they're, if for, uh, because they were doing research on demonic presences and shit, they have a safe zone where if there's ever too high of a demonic presence, um, the doors will, they'll have a lockdown for that area. So basically I have to remove the demonic presence for the lockdown to go away. See, I feel like that studying demonic energy is just bad in the first place. Like, I feel like it's pretty well, up there it's with free messing unlimited. with it's, it's free unlimited energy if you're able to tap into it. And they were. They're able to tap into Argent energy just fine. It's just some of them decided to do some um, little bit more experiments on actual demons. But see, that's pretty much up there mm. with fucking yeah. with a Ouija board and or going towards the scary sound you hear in a dark house. You just mm. don't do it. You always go towards the scary sound. You always. never go towards the scary sound. Always go towards it. Pfft. Well, if you have a death wish, then by all means. Yeah. Oh yeah, I got a blue attic theft key. What Which is sort of kind of funny how they how they um, introduce it. Because like, normally they're hidden and you got to try to figure out where it is. Uh -huh. But in this one, it's just like, well, there's not a door, but I could go that way. <laughs> and it's just a dead end where the access key is. So... Well, see, how else are you supposed to know what an access key is? They don't guide you Magic. to it. Magic. I have frag grenades on. That's fun. You should use one. <laughs> Can you actually destroy those buildings? No. Uh, there's, like, small containers and stuff that occasionally you could destroy. Gotcha. Alright, let's see. There's some things here that I'm gonna... This is, like, the only area where I'm gonna grab secrets on. Um, secrets? Pray tell, what are secrets? Uh, different things, actually. There's lots of different secrets. I don't know where all this... I, I, I don't know where one of the secrets are. The only secrets that I haven't actually gone through and looked for 
are the um, what's called the uh, oh the the um, levels. Uh, you could get uh, Doom One levels unlocked. I haven't found the levers to open up those, um, but because they don't show up on the map, you just have to like figure out where on the map there's a blank spot that you can't get to behind like a secret wall or something, and then there's a lever near it. And I just haven't really looked for that by the end of the level. And this thing, which isn't a secret really, is your auto map. Uh, you already have an auto map, and it'll show you where you've been and shit. But this one, it uh, after you get that, it'll actually load up the normal area. Nice. And I don't have it right now, but there will be a thing where it'll just show me where all the secrets are. Fun. All the secrets. And this is one of the secrets I was going to get. It's called a Praetor token. A Praetor token? Yes. What does this token do? It allows me to upgrade my suit. Snap. Like that. Uh, da -da -da. So, technically, uh, dang it, shut up. Technically, there should be um, secrets being shown up on this map. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know why there aren't, to be honest. This is just weird. Oh, no, there are. There are. Oh, I missed him. I thought that he was further. <laughs> I thought he was further down. Oh, screw it. I'm going to find him because I want to show you what this is. What? Good job. I punched him a little bit to the right. <laughs> I think you just punched the air. Let's be real. He was right in front of me. I, I don't think he was. Not really. Oh, wait. Can I knock it back? Oh, yeah, I can. Dude, so we're off to find the secret? Yes, we're off to find a secret. The dirty little secret. Secret, secret. Or no fun. They're no fun? Secrets are always fun, Michael. Okay. Secrets I've destroy lives. I actually don't lives. think that I've ever found this one. I didn't know it existed until now, but it's going to be really easy to find. Is it right here? It's like a little doll. Oh my gosh! It's a little action Wait. figure. Oh no, he doesn't do it under this one. Uh... Yeah. I knew that you'd like that. That one's So now guy. we know that Doom Guy has a doll fetish. Sure. I'm just gonna ignore that comment Okay. What is wrong with you? I hey. think you're just bad at killing them. I don't think there's anything wrong with them. Yeah, personally. Just... Except for the fact that they're possessed. That's probably something wrong with them. Probably. I haven't used a pistol in so long. Because, like, you barely run into those guys, and by the time you do run into more of them, uh, aside from this area, oh, that, that was there, um, you, you just have uh, more ammo. If you're smart, you'll have more ammo upgrades. Gotcha. Doop -doop. Hello, little guy. Ooh, hello, hello drone. Him. Yeah, I'm missing a secret, I think, back there, but it doesn't really matter. Oh, good. oh why yeah. did you do that? I don't think he knows where he's going. Okay, I got it. Dismissed, thank you. Explosive shot. This is what makes the shotgun really awesome, what? especially when you, uh, Why yeah. would you punch him? He just gave you things. That's uh, so this, mean. This is what makes the shotgun pretty awesome, uh, especially when you upgrade it. When you don't upgrade it, it's sort of kind of, it's not that great, but, because it should have a bigger explosive range. It will have a shorter cooldown. You won't have to wait a second for it to actually load into the gun, like I just did. Well, so I mean, yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty That's good. nice. Um, can you not? And also, when you fully upgrade it, uh, there's this thing called um, a master challenge or map weapon mastery. Um, and the mastery for this is a um, it's called a cluster bomb. So if you get a direct hit on anything. It'll turn into this giant AOE explosion, which is pretty awesome. Very nice. Um, and also, uh, but to get a mastery, you have to do a mastery challenge. And like the challenge for this is you have to get 20 direct shots on imps, which isn't that hard. But um, yeah. <laughs> yes. 
Alright. So, let's see, how far are we in just... Oh wait, we're not that far in the story. Never mind. Thought that we learned. There really hasn't been anything in the story. No, it'll pick up more once I get into other areas. And also, part of it is like you actually read shit, um, if you want, for story. Um, which I might do at some point. You read things? Yeah. Reading is for losers. Oh, is it this one that he does with? No, it's not this one that he does it with. I think it's, okay, his Doom guy, like actual Doom guy figure, he does something really awesome. Oh, yeah. Just oh, and pause also, the dramatic yeah. effect, is that what that was? Yeah. Um, also, glory kills, uh, there are multiple kinds, so like if I were to uh, do it from behind, if I were to do it from the front, um, it'll be different than if I were to... For the side and whatnot, and above. Of course, because in Doom you have to be creative with the way that you kill these things. Oh. Yeah, pretty much. Normally from the back it involves breaking their spine or neck. That's nice. Or you could just blow them to bits. I can, and in fact I rather enjoy it because it's easier to get rid of them. It's probably also a little bit cathartic, you know. Yeah. Whatever, whatever you say. I feel finding people blow into a million different pieces. Dear cathartic. God. Dear God. I think God has nothing to do with this. Yeah, nothing at all. <laughs> but you know, doesn't mean I can't go a boosh on their face. A boosh. Go boosh on their a face. A boosh is that the technical term? Yeah. A boosh on their face. Yeah, you just gotta, just gotta, like, if there's just a crowd in front of you, you just gotta go, like, excuse me, excuse me, excuse And then you go me. boosh on their face. Yeah. Sounds rather dirty. I feel excuse like you shouldn't do that me. in public. Well, it's, you're not, you go boosh, but you go a boosh on their face, because you don't do multiple boosh, you just do a boosh. That two separate sounds words, sounds really wrong. You sound wrong. I, I can't help that. You're the one who's saying it. Yeah, well, sorry. It sucks to be you. It sucks to be me? Yeah. Well. This yeah. I feel like it sucks to be that guy. Yeah, probably honest. a little bit, but you know, whatever. It also sucks to be these guys. True. His poor arm. It must have hurt. Although he's a demon, so do demons feel pain? Do we know? Um. Maybe. I feel like there are vague grunts of pain, but I don't know if that really constitutes as pain, or if it's more of an, oh shit, my arm is broken. Hmm, I don't know. Um, some people feel that demons don't actually die, that they just constantly respawn in hell and then come back for you. Oh, that's nice. So basically, the more you kill, the more pissed off you make them. Well, so I don't really believe that. Um, people only believe that because they don't um, understand the story fully, and their logic is because of how are there so many demons here, why do they keep coming? But there's so many demons here because they pulled so many out of hell to do experiments on. That there's already a lot of demons here who are, once they got free from their cages, were easily able to open up. Hell portals and shit. I feel like that's comfort. still a fuck ton of demons. Like, you know, pull out three or five. All of hell, understandable. Holly. Still a fuck ton of demons. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and it's not until the third mission, I think, where you get, like, everything unlocked. Because, like, as you go, I think that we're going to get introduced to the guy here. Um, he starts giving you more and more things to upgrade your suit upgrade your suit and it just allows you to get more upgrades faster basically let's yeah, see if this is him i think know this is your him. enemy we have to know our enemy michael um yeah um there's the possessed there's imps there are mancubus there's cockademons there's I feel hell like knights Doom guy doesn't know that at this point though how would he um, know that actually he would know oh sorry from this oh well yeah which oh. i'm too lazy to read so oh, hello hey. <laughs> I am Vega, the sentient intelligence assigned to Mars. Hello, Vega. After running diagnostics on the Praetor suit, it appears that I can activate optional challenges that, when completed, will 
Assist in upgrading your arsenal at an accelerated date. See, Vega sounds nice. Vega sounds helpful. Not like the Mars director. I want a tracking component to your Sam and Hayden. Such a kind guy. I would trust Vega much more than I would trust the other dude. But Samuel Hayden programmed and signed Vega. Well, that's just. Fan of animation. Good. But actually, what are they? That was a good question. Because, see, if you do them, you get more. If I, uh, one treat, that's easy. Uh, five different glory kills, three secrets, whatever. That looks nice. Okay, this is where I'm at. No disaster scenario is ever going to have power. Because that's just too easy. God forbid they give you a little bit of power to do what you need to do. Yeah. Come on, line up. No, I don't, don't think wanna... they want to line up. I don't think they like it very much. Well, they're, they're starting to. Oh, there's a big guy. No, he's not a big guy, he's just a I was gonna say, he still looks kind of small. Although those fireballs, on the other hand. Oh, come on. Ha ha ha. Whatever. Hey, you're running low on ammo. You know how little I care. I mean, I could just force open any door I want. Well, but you couldn't open up that last door. Yeah, I could. Just took me a second to find the, where it opened up. Doors are challenging for you, Michael. Admit it. Uh, no, I know how to walk right into them. Just <laughs> fine. <laughs> of course you do. And we guess they'll reset the power. Oh yeah, now we're gonna meet Olivia Pierce, I believe her name is. Yeah. That's a nice satellite. Yes. It's not really shaped like a satellite though. You kinda have to have the dish. Pretty sure that's how the sound works. How the little signals bounce off of it. They don't have that. They broke it. They broke science. No, they didn't. Not bad. <laughs> I think you're just making her mad. You can't see me. You can't see me. She really has no faith in you. Well, yeah, she she was the one who's actually keeping me in the stone. To oh, yeah. keep me from doing shit. That's nice, because God forbid we actually, you know, get rid of the hell demons yeah, that we she's spawned. trying to open up the portal and shit. She's the leader of the cult. This is dead space. Yeah. Fun. Uh, this might take me a couple tries, but I know you can do it. So it's slightly more challenging than the door? No, never mind. I said it might take me a couple tries. Secret found. Wasn't that such an awesome secret? I know, right? And it was just hidden so well. I mean, you turn a corner. My point was that those are actually really pointless to be secret because it's just armor. Gotcha. And it was sort of hidden well because if you didn't know, you could get up there. Or if you try to get up there and it's like, oh, I can't get up there. Oh, well. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Just have to have determination. You can do it too. That's a lie. If you tried to do the things that Doom Guy is doing right now, you would die. Nah, I don't think so. I think you would. You would die hardcore. If you were wearing his suit? You would still die hardcore. Nah. Yes. Nah. Oh. Thank you. It's exactly what I wanted to happen. And can you not? How, how's that going for you? Can, can you can you not? How's that working? What? That I don't know what's going on with that guy. I'm just gonna. He's he's officially gone. I think you're getting a phone call. You might wanna either mute it or answer it in such a way. Yeah, who cares? Yeah, spice of death. Now I just need to do one from above. Goodbye. 
kind of like the way they just appear. This giant red flame thing of energy. Mm -hmm. So then they throw the flaming red energy at you, and I'm sure that's not so fun. Firebolts. I'm just there we go. Alright, so okay. Oh dear god, so damn it. Where was Oh that was Hayden's voice, wasn't it? Alright. Uh I guess I gotta go through here. Oh, it's a door. Can you do it? Yeah, yeah I can, Holly. Are you sure? Yeah. So you open the door, and there's a fuck ton of demons behind it. So was it really worth opening the door? They all died easily. They're supposed to die cooler because that guy, because us engineer, he'll blow up after you shoot him and he goes flying. But I, so, but I didn't fully hit him enough for him to go flying. So you didn't get to see the awesomeness because there was a barrel set up perfectly, so he was just gonna kill everything once he exploded. Of course. That's the way it was set up, but I failed at it. Congratulations. Oop, here we go. Well, snap. I had to complete the challenge. Their heads literally just, like, disintegrate into a puddle of blood. Yes. Like, there's no bones in that. Let's go find a little bit of Nice. Yeah. Hello. I really like breaking people's arms. It's fun and it gets you health. Because honestly, health is the first thing that you're ever going to want to upgrade in this game. Yeah. Goodbye. Um, normally what I do is I'll do health um, health and ammo. I'll rotate between those. Because uh, armor, while it can be helpful, um, not until later in the game is it really going to be that effective for you. So, yeah, that's a thing. Is that it? Are they dead yet? No, oh, no, they're not. There's this ominous beeping in the background. I feel like something's that's going just to explode. That's just the music. Explode. I'll take this. Is that a chainsaw? Yeah. That's Classic Doom awesome. Weapon. It gets you ammo. Beautiful. And it can kill pretty much anything in this game aside from the bosses. And except for the hologram, clearly. Well, because I'm not using it right now. I'm pretty sure you still couldn't kill the hologram. Chainsaw is different though, because that has its own hot button. Snap. Put through the wall. Do it. Alright, I'm going to show you how the chainsaw works when you uh, slice and dice. Yeah, so that that's a thing. Wow, that's okay. fancy. Oh gosh, it's lagging like crazy. There we go. Nope. What the heck? I didn't think he hit me. Okay, so this area, originally it took me forever to figure out where the heck I had to go, mainly because I was too distracted by wanting to go in there. Uh, which is just a secret room. Gotcha. But, you know, I figured it out. And actually, what I'm going to do is end the episode right here. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching, join us for the next one, and goodbye! See you guys!